Hey Dick, this is Tony Zanaski here with Fun With Dirt. Thanks for tuning in. I'm messing around this little baseball field right down the street from my house and I just came over here. I'm pretty much right behind second base and I just got this right here. Really cool coin. It's a uh, 100 colognes and it's from uh, Costa Rica. Pretty cool coin. So yeah, it's from 1997. I'll do a close up. Yeah, I was just digging around and it's like right under the soil, like uh, probably, I'd say two inches. So yeah, good stuff and I guess I'll see you at the next hole. Have a great day. Bye. Hey diggers, this is Tony Danesky here with Fun With Dirt. Thanks for tuning in. I'm at a baseball field and I just switched over to the so uh, well, football field and I came right down over here in the middle of the field and I just got a nice little signal. It's a ring, it's got a little, uh, some rubies in it and stuff. It looks fake though. There's no markings inside though, so yeah, I guess it's just a junker. I will see you at the next hole. Have a good day. Bye. Hey Dick, it's Tony Danesky here with Fun With Dirt. Thanks for tuning in. I'm still in that football field. I'm just messing around like right near the goalpost. And I came over here and I got a little signal and it's a little cardinal. Uh, I don't know if it's the baseball team or not, but it's got a little note in there, like a musical note. So I don't know what that's all about, but it's, uh, I was ringing up, uh, let's see. Not like a 88, actually, on the, uh, days. So, yeah, I dug it, and, yeah, this is what it is. There was a little chain with it, but it broke off. So I'm guessing that was all fake, so I guess I'll see you at the next hole. Have a good day. Bye. Hey diggers, it's Tony Tanaski here with Fun With Dirt. Thanks for tuning in. I'm still at that football field. I'm just messing around over here. I got uh, probably right in like midfield and I just got a really awesome signal and it's a, uh, check it out. It's a uh, shield nickel. Yeah, it was only going down a few inches. I haven't actually uh, been able to get the date off of it, but there's the five. And yeah, I'm really happy with this fine. Hopefully there'll be more stuff in this field. It was only going down about eh, five inches, I'd say. But yeah, it's actually, you know, decent shape. I, hopefully there'll be a date on the other side. So I guess I will see people at the next hole. Have a good day. Bye. Hey, Diggers, it's Tony Danesky here with Phone With Dirt. Thanks for tuning in. I'm right down the road from my house at this one school that I practiced metal detecting when I first started. I haven't been here in probably like five years, I'd say. I didn't really hit this place because I didn't really understand like the uh, basics of metal detecting. So I came back and uh, yeah, I'm here with the day use today. And uh, one of the first finds I found today was a 1920 wheat scent. It was going down about about five inches. Yeah, it's uh, in decent shape, I guess. You can't really uh, get the you can get the date off it, but it's. Uh, the sun is just making it impossible. But yeah, I guess I will see you at the next hole. Have a good day. Bye. Hey Dickens, it's Tony Danesky again. I'm still, I'm probably like 10 feet away from where I was before when I found that one uh, 1920 wheat sign. And just got a, I think it's a 1956 one. Right here in the hole. We call it, it's a, uh, it's only going down about uh, five, six inches. So it's a, uh, Decent fine. This place is, uh, probably hasn't been hit really, except for by me, me, and I missed everything. So hopefully I'll be finding some good stuff. I guess I'll see you at the next hole. Have a good day. Bye. Hey Diggers, it's Tony Tedeschi here with Phone With Dirt. Thanks for tuning in. I'm probably like five feet away from where I found that 1956 wheat scent. And I was going over this little area right along this fence line. And yeah, I came across a 90 signal and popped out right here. It's a, looks like a ring. It was ringing in the 90s. So yeah, I'll just do it live in video. So here you go. Ooh, that's a nice one. I guess it's got little hearts on it. So, yeah. Um, it's looking silverish to me, so I will uh, clean it up and I will show you right after this. Bye. Hey, Dick, this is Tony Tanaski. Uh, the ring's silver. I just uh, see right here the marking. I just can't see exactly what it is. The uh, It's an adjustable one, and the adjustable part seems to be fake silver or plated at least so but the rest of the ring is real silver it's pretty cool looking it's got two hearts on it it's neat decent yeah i found it down uh, six inches right here in the hole so yeah i guess uh 
Hopefully I'll be finding a lot more. I just got here. I've been here for 20 minutes, I'd say. I'll see you at the next hole. Have a great day. Bye. Hey Diggers, it's Tony Denise here with Home Thanks for tuning in. I'm still messing around that school. I'm like, I was right over there before and I came to here in this little baseball field and I just got here behind second base and got a really interesting signal. It's a, like a yin and yang thing. Or, uh, yeah, so. But yeah, it was got a little soccer thing on the other side of it, so. Yeah, pretty cool signal. It was down only like four inches, so I guess I'll see you at the next hole. Have a good day. Bye. Hey Diggers, it's Tony Janayski here with Fun With Dirt, thanks for tuning in. I'm still messing around that baseball field. I just got behind third base out in left field, and I just got this nice little interesting coin right here. It's a 1973 Barbados coin. It's five cents. It's got a nice little crest on the front. I see a bird and some sort of uh, fish. And then on the other side, it's got a nice little uh, lighthouse on the other side. It's pretty cool. It's, uh, yeah, it's just right under the soil, about three inches. And yeah, I guess I will see you at the next hole. Have a great day. Bye. Hey Diggers, it's Tony Janeski here with Fun With Dirt, thanks for tuning in. Me and Greg, we're down the street from our house. This is another field that we actually never hit before. We just got here, we've been here for about an hour, I'd say. We were first over at the other field, like a baseball field, but it was full of garbage. So we decided to come over here to these football fields, soccer field areas, and uh, we're glad we did because right over here, I think, was it the uh, 10 yard line, I'd say right here, I got a nice little uh, silver ring, I think, in the hole. It's still in the clump, but yeah, it's a uh, very, uh, decorative looking so I'm gonna try to clean it here on that's really nice actually very uh looks like it's really old actually but let me see if I can clean this off a lot of dirt in there yeah it's a very nice looking ring so far somebody stepped on it so it's not cracked though let's see See, right there, 925, you can see in the hole in the bottom. Where's that 920, maybe? Right there, actually. See that? It might be 625, or maybe I'm just wrong. See right there? So, yeah, nice little ring. Still got dirt in it, I gotta clean it off. But yeah, great find. I mean, there's, I thought there were stones in it, but it's just a uh, decoration. Yeah, great find. And yeah, hopefully we'll be uh, finding a lot more of this stuff because we just got here and we got like a few hours left. So hopefully we'll be finding a lot more and I guess I'll see you at the next hole. Have a great day, folks. Good afternoon everyone, it's Greg with Fun With Dirt and we're still at the same football field that we've uh, been at all afternoon and uh, Tony found a, a silver ring down there by the goal posts and about at, uh, I don't know, looks like about the 30 yard line here I uh, found some silver myself. Uh, I found a, a, well, a crucifix pendant. It's a small one, about four inches down. It's not too bad. Uh, well, the, on all the, uh, uh, Jesus symbol uh, has come off but on the back it definitely says sterling sweet yeah dude look at the abs on him man well hey well, yeah, I, we're, we're in a football field <laughs> yep we're doing his cardio yep we'll, we'll watch it over everything <laughs> but yeah uh, there we go uh, some more silver I think what was it uh, second silver of the day yeah yeah, right here, and uh, we're still gonna be uh, looking around and finding some more. We still got some daylight left to go, so we're gonna we'll see you at the next hole. Sweet, see ya. Oh, 
good afternoon everyone. This is Greg with Phone With Air and I'm right here at probably what looks like to be about the 50 yard line. I'm halfway across and about four inches down I found something very interesting. It looks like uh, some sort of Japanese or Asian mining token. Um, don't know if it's silver or not. I mean it looks it came out of the ground pretty clean but I don't know what that is. It says, let me see. Sumoto? Sumoto, yeah. Yeah. Metal Mining Company? Yeah. LTD. Yeah. I thought it might have been a button, because I flip it over, and along the top there is a, a marking of two little Asian characters. So I'm, I'm assuming it was Japanese. Um, cool. going to assume it's not a button, even though the uh, center mark right there um, is, is smooth. It might have been uh, a fob attached to something and maybe the metal piece fell off. I'm not sure. But it's pretty interesting. It looks like, uh, looks like a token. Sweet. Now, if anybody has any idea what it could be, uh, let us know because this is a new one for me. Sweet. See you at the next hole, everyone. Great. Hey diggers, it's Tony Daneski here with Phone with Dirt. Thanks for tuning in. Me and Greg, we're at this old school that we we're at a couple, like a month ago, I'd say. And uh, we're coming around here, just messing around. And I just got a wheat scent over there. I wasn't sure what year it was, so I didn't record it. But over here, I just got a little uh, Girl Scout uh, button right here. I think it's a button. It might be a pin, but it looks kind of like a three leaf, four leaf clover, but three leaf. But yeah, it's only going down about uh, five inches. Uh, it's really moist out here, so we're, you know, praying that we find some good stuff because we've already found a Tootsie Toy here and I think a couple of rings and stuff. So hopefully we'll be finding a lot more stuff and, uh, yeah, I guess I'll see you at the next hole. Have a good day. Hey, Diggins, it's Tony Danesky here with Fun With Dirt. Thanks for tuning in. Me and Greg, we're still messing around that school. We're coming up the mountain right behind this uh, tree. Came down over here and it's got something that was a little uh, tiny... I think it's a compass. If you look inside, you can see the little arrow inside there. With the north, east, and west, south, and all that. But yeah, tiny, this thing. But yeah, it was only going down a couple inches, and it was ringing up a 71. So I guess I will see you at the next hole. Have a good day. Bye. Hey Diggins, it's Tony Danesky here with Fun With Dirt. I'm still messing around that hill uh, with Craig. He's all the way over there, and I just came up here. And I just got a little, uh, I think it's a fishing weight. Very small one, but yeah. It's, uh, it's ringing up a 94, so who knows what's made out of it. But yeah, good stuff, and I guess I'll see you at the next hole. Have a good day. Bye. Hey, Dick, it's Tony Dadeski. I'm coming dirt. Thanks for tuning in. I'm still messing around that hill, and I just got a little tiny find right here. It's actually a little person. Uh, I think it's like a pin or something like that, but yeah, it's got a little figure on there. It was only going down about five inches, but yeah, I guess the uh, pin back was right there or whatever. So yeah, I guess I will see you at the next hole and have a good day. Bye. Hey, Dick, it's Tony Danesky here with Phone Dirt. Thanks for tuning in. Me and Greg, we're still messing around that, that hill. Greg's at the bottom of the over there. I just came up here near the fence line and I just got a, I think it's a ring in this hole. Looks pretty old, but you know, it's definitely a ring. So, looks like it's brass or something like that. So I guess I will clean it up and I'll show you after I'm done cleaning it. Have a good day, bye. Hey Dick, this is me again. I got the ring cleaned up. It's uh, fake, but yeah, pretty nice design. Little, uh, let's see, fits my, barely fits my index finger. So yeah, I guess I will see you at the next hole. Have a good day, bye. Hey Diggers, it's Tony Danesky here with Phone with Dirt. Thanks for tuning in. We're still messing around that hill. I just got a little crappy ring over there that was uh, plated and stuff. I got a couple of Wheaties over here. I got a little Girl Scout, I think, compass over there, a tiny little thing, and a Girl Scout, I think, uh, badge. And right here, I just got a real, the best find so far. It looks like it's a copper. I mean, it's, you know, the size of a half dollar, but yeah, I'm just gonna 
See if I could brush it lightly to see what's going on there. Uh, don't really see much, but yeah, let's see the other side. Oh, it looks like it might be a large scent. Yeah, there you go, one scent right there. Yeah, one scent right there. I think that says one scent. Yeah, one scent. Let's see what the other side looks like. I don't really see your face, really. Hmm. Not seeing a head on there. But the other side looks a lot better. I guess I will clean it up and I will show you at home when I'm done cleaning because it's not very taking a good real picture out here. Yep, I guess I will see you at the next hole. Have a great day, folks. Hey diggers, it's Tony Tedeschi here with Fun With Dirt. Me and Greg, we decided to come back to the same place that we came yesterday where I found that uh, large scent up there on the hill. And we just got here, I'd say got a couple pieces of clad, uh, pencils, foil, and a couple other pieces of garbage. And I just came around here, we're not even halfway up the hill, and I just got another large scent right here in the hole, if you wanna come take a look at it. It was only going down about, uh, I think, was it five inches? Oh, actually eight inches was going down. But yeah, it was a, uh, it's a matron. I haven't cleaned it up yet because uh, yesterday I almost wiped out the whole thing on it. So I'm going to clean it at home and I'll just uh, show you guys then. But yeah, you can see the uh, one scent right there. Really nice wreath on there. But yeah. It was, uh, it's really nice out here. It's 40 degrees. It's, the wind's barely picking up. So we're hopefully we'll find more stuff. And yeah, I guess I will see you at the next hole. Have a great day, folks. Bye. Hey diggers, it's Tony Tedeschi here with Fun With Dirt, thanks for tuning in. We're still messing around that place where I just showed that large scent, and I just came over here and I just got something that looks like a little type of a wrench or something. It's very small though. If I look at it in my hand, it's, you know, but yeah, it's got a point on one end and uh, looks like some sort of, you know, like some sort of wrench thing. So yeah, pretty cool find. I guess I'll see you in the next hole. Have a good day. Bye. Good afternoon everyone, this is Greg with Fun With Dirt. Uh, it's Sunday afternoon and we are at the base of a hill uh, in that same field that we were at earlier today. And we were here yesterday also. But I found something very interesting, all the relics. And it was the full length of the, the uh, pin pointer down, but it's a really old button. Uh, I cleaned it up a little bit, it has the shank on the back and around it, it says fine orange gilt, and uh, I guess the manufacturer, man, M-A-N-N, -N, with a little number below the shank, 230. Yeah, yeah it's, uh, it's identifiable on the back. On the front, it's just a, just a plain button. But uh, about, fi about 15 feet uh, to, my, uh, to my left over here, um, I, I found a, a little swan pin right alongside it. So it was right along the same line and it's kind of, kind of interesting. I mean, no silver today, no, um, uh, you know, other than clad, two relics, a nice uh, old button and a nice swan pin. So can't complain. Uh, today I broke out my uh, Noctiforce core with my big 15 inch coil. So mm -hmm. see how that works on this field and it's working out really good. Cool. Well, see you at the next hole, everyone. Hey diggers, it's Tony Tedeschi with Fun With Dirt. Thanks for tuning in. We're still messing around that hill. We just got to the bottom of the hill. And uh, yeah, we came messing around this little area right where we got the uh, large set earlier. And I just hit this right here, underneath this uh, rock right here. It was a, let's see, a plated uh, pendant for like religious stuff. I mean, it says, uh, let's see. Let's see what's right on there. So yeah, it's, uh, it's all coming apart, but it says Italy on there in the back and stuff. Good find, and hopefully we'll find more stuff. I guess I'll see you in the next hole. Have a good day. Bye.